Hey guys, let's talk gin and tonic. Now the gin and tonic was born on the battlefields of India and invented by British soldiers. You see, these British soldiers needed to take two different styles of medicine. One made from juniper berries and another made from quinine or chinchona bark, which warded off malaria. Soon they figured out if they put these two ingredients together and added some sugar, it made them feel pretty good. And it tasted pretty good too. Let's make a gin and tonic. The first step is to ice up our glass. Again, the more ice we have, the less dilution, the colder the drink. Then we're gonna start off with a London dry gin. I've selected Sipsmith, and I'm gonna give a nice helping of 60 milliliters of Sipsmith gin. A good gin needs a good tonic. And I've decided to use Fever Tree Indian Tonic. And lastly, some fresh lime. Now I know a lot of your bartenders like to just pop this into the top, but I like to squeeze it in there to just release all those flavors. And there you have it, a classic gin and tonic.